Hello, valued viewers. I hope you're all doing very well. Welcome to the Flashpoint Cyprus campaign. Mission three, Bean Send. Hi, everybody, and thanks, Cap, for that. Yep, uh, so we're on mission three. It's now the next day. Uh, so it's really 24 hours on from when mission one started. Um, as you know, there's been some increase in hostilities going on some protests and violent um there was you know the shooting down of a hawk by uh turkish sams uh there was uh an attack on a Turkish base by Heinz that were uh, pretending to be UN Heinz, but might have been rebels. Uh, they managed to escape last mission, so we'll have to see what happens to them going on into the future. Um, but effectively, the Turkish Republic of uh, Northern Cyprus is really, really not happy with what's been going on, and uh, they obviously issued these ultimatums threatening to unilaterally move ahead and reoccupy the, the Green Belt Zone that's uh, currently being occupied by the United Nations. Uh, now, the, the Brits have tried to put forward a, a UN Security Council resolution that was uh, vetoed by Russia and China to try and uh, put off the TRNC from doing anything crazy. Uh, as a result, uh, it really kind of seems like the TRNC are going ahead and building up uh, their uh, ground uh, assets. Um, I mean, the, the Turkish forces, uh, as in Turkey, mainland Turkey, don't really seem to be commenting at the, this time. Uh, we haven't seen any movement from any of their heavy armor or any of their other assets, but they have protested the use of the retired Mirage F1s. And they've said, you know, if things don't de-escalate, then they will start basing their F-16s and other more modern assets on the island. Uh, in response, the Cypriot National Guard have started to reassemble the S-300 uh, SAM system that they bought several years ago, and they kind of had a big diplomatic row with the north about that and then didn't assemble it they've started saying well if you're going to do that we'll assemble our s300 and uh, so things are escalating quite quickly we're now in a situation where we're uh, only a few minutes away from the deadline that the trnc put on everybody to hand over the uh, the hind pilots that perpetrated the crimes uh, in the north as you know we didn't manage to apprehend them so that's not going to happen and there were several other demands as well, such as uh, Cyprus not going and joining the EU and uh, the EU and asking TRNC to ratify their presence there and recognize them as a country, etc. So none of those are going to be met. So we're kind of on a bit of a knife edge as to whether this uh, conflict is all going to kick off. In amongst all of this, the UK obviously not making any headway with the UN Security Council, working with the Cypriot government and the Greek government to enforce a no-fly zone. Uh, and it's hoped that this no-fly zone around southern Cyprus will help to de-escalate things. As it is, quite a lot of uh, assets are not in the area at this time, so we're really going to then rely on the Harriers to enforce this no-fly zone. As you know, we've only got the... Um, the uh, night attack version in, in DCS, we don't have the 2 plus with uh, uh, or the Sea Harrier version with the Amram, so it'll be just Sidewinders and Hawks as well being pressed into service for this. Uh, the idea being that, uh, you know, sometime in the future we would have the Greeks turning up with uh, their much better uh, air to air platforms such as the Mirage 2000 and F 16s. So the main job for today will be the Harriers, the Mirage F 1s, and the Hawks are going to enforce this no fly zone. Uh, the idea is, is anyone that enters the area will be uh, communicated to by by these aircraft and asked to leave politely from the, the green zone uh, or southern Cyprus. And if they don't, then you're allowed to take whatever measures to uh, to get them to leave or, or shoot them down. Um, the RAF uh, Pumas and the Apaches have a good job to do, which is to go and assault the warehouse on the south coast of Cyprus where um, the speedboats were launched from last time. There's like a small port, and uh, that's where the speedboats that attacked HMS Ocean came from. So they think by assaulting that warehouse, putting some troops in there, um, we can try and get some intel on where the Enosis rebels have been getting all their heavy weapons from. Uh, in terms of the, the UN Hueys, uh, they are going to be doing a mixture of transporting troops and sling loading supplies to Nicosia. Um, there's three main pep uh, checkpoints that separate the North Nicosia from South Nicosia, and they need reinforcing because all these threats of uh, unilateral reoccupation, etc., are quite concerning. So they want to put up some more concrete barriers and uh, put in some more troops there. From the Greek Air Force and the Cypriot National Guard uh, point of view, um, there we do have a, a flight of F-1 uh, Mirages that can help uh, pad out the cap. I mean, obviously, they've got uh, uh, Fox-1 uh, missiles, so that helps a little bit. 
Um, but the other job they've got is with their uh, Heinz. This is the, the Goody Heinz, the Cypriot National Guard Heinz, um, and the Cypriot Gazelles are going to assault the farm that was being used by the bad Heinz uh, last mission. And it's hoped uh, by doing that, if they're successful in putting their troops down there, then uh, they can get some intel onto where the, uh, the Enosis have escaped to and perhaps try and capture them another time. In terms of rules of engagement, uh, again, it's uh, it's going to be a situation where you have to VID everything f uh, first before firing upon them. Um, you, British forces can now enter within the green line uh, as part of establishing a snowfly zone. Um, again, it's don't fire unless you're fired upon uh, situation, and that extends to anything. So whether it be enemy aircraft, enemy SAMs, uh, ground fire, if any of those fire upon you, you can then take your own initiative to go and attack them. Uh, the British forces can again only use Akatir in Kingsfield, and Greek forces use Paphos. And again, watch out for any civilian aircraft, make sure you VID everything. Um, I think that's pretty much it, unless... Uh, just to mention, there is combined arms, so if anyone gets shot down, you can use the tank range. Um, please make sure you've got the two liveries, the Harrier livery and the M24, Mi-24 livery. Uh, Springfield, Harriers Invincible, Cap, Horath, High, Tanky, Dodge, Harriers, Sp Invincible, Makabu, Elo, Colt, Harriers, Akratori, Matrix, Ali B, Colt, Hawks, Bendy, RAF Pumas, HMS Ocean, Tuxel, Poosh, Hueys, Shrak, Lucky, Apaches, HMS Ocean, Skill, Flood, Space Chef, Mayhem, uh, Cypriot National Guard, Gazelle, Arty, Hind, Sock, Red, Plight, Chopsticks, Mirage F1, Jigsaw, Unexpected, Right, four sidewinders, two bags. That'll do me. Caution, caution. Caution, caution. Right, caution, checks. Caution. Done. Done. Caution, Done. Caution. Done. Yep. Caution, Springfield caution. lead taking off. Watch this go wrong. Caution, caution. Hello, lady. Jigsaw running up. Airborne left orbit. Right there, Bourne. Right, that's a lot of us guys. I am setting course for north, north, north. Copy. 
Hi viewers. Roy Vichar, I'm with Benio, joining Echelon Roy. Let's go and protect this airspace, shall we? So we're heading to the middle sector, uh, between there and there. So we've got that area there. We've got to go on. My high. Hello. Right, see what we got on, on the old uh, emitter. Snowdrift. Sentry. Ship. Lots of ships. And more ships. We're expediting our climb. Okay, accelerating 360. And uh, fence in, um, weapons light. Once we get to um, Larnaca, we'll, uh, we'll just see what's going on. Lots of helicopters out uh, 10 miles to the side of Larnaca, to the east of Larnaca. Our helicopter's going north. What if I let on? Uh, some Greek mirages. 4.20. Uh, left 9 o'clock, uh, 15 miles. Ali, what kind of flight level are you going to be maintaining? Yeah, we're just at 5,000 feet. If the initial threat is helicopters, we're going to stay down at 5,000 and um, as things progress, we're going to go lower. Roger. And we're actually overhead Larnaca at this time. Okay. Guys, we're going to stay at 15,000 until we get closer. Yeah, we're still heading east. So Ali's lot are doing that sector there, my lot are doing that sector there, and the Mirages are doing that sector there. Hey guys, we're heading down to uh, 5,000. I got us 20 miles until patrol area. There is a Huey um, in our one o'clock about uh, 10 miles, which is uh, on the best correct side at the moment. If you want to trail behind us by a couple of miles, then that might make life a bit easier. Uh, yeah, right on your right wing. Well, you want to, one of us know some of you guys high? Yeah, just try not to get too far ahead of me, guys. Yeah, I'll keep you visual. I'm just gonna pull my nose down, see the horizon better. Yeah. Any cap, there's a group of, what, about four Hueys, two miles west of Kingsville. Is that for you, Ali? You're near Kingsfield, aren't you? 
Uh, we just had a report two miles west of Kingsfield uh, for UVs that needed 70. Yeah, that's what we're looking for now. We're chasing them now. Okay. Well Alright, where's those targets? I'm just looking to the clock. I see four contacts to the clock 097. I'm expanding my low. Okay, the seven miles on the clock. Yeah. Right to left. No, so where the smoke is, boys, there's three helicopters. They are hostile. Where well, the explosions just happened mm -hmm. three seconds. So I'm turning left orbit to have a go at them. Enemy choppers, I see smoke and they're calling for three. I see three. Let's go. I think Ali's boys are there, so just be careful. Yeah, it's a huge amount of luck here, but we are at Kingsville having a go at them. Roy, I'm getting, I'm behind you, boys. I see you. Yeah, they're on the ground. 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 Caps guys were heading north for five miles, a left pull. Active visual on helicopters. Yeah, I've lost them yet. Okay, um, we'll just get back on our cap line, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll be on the coast where the um, power station is, um, just to the um, southeast. Guys, a left pull westbound. Roger, ready for anything. We're heading back to those smoke stacks where our guys are in combat to the northwest. Uh, Cold one, Cold three, I've got visual helicopters on the ground in the smoke. I'm not sure if that's us, but I'm going to turn south just to make sure, guys, I may have slipped in by accident. Three minutes to get out. Let me north, south, east, or west of the smoke? Uh, west. Copy. Ready, viewers, we can't go into Turkish uh, airspace or workshop there. There is a large white building and a small grey building. It's about uh, in between the two. So take us in, I'm taking us into the south. Tanky, don't stray out to come left with us. Uh, I've got a target in front of me, I'm just going to investigate what it is. You're in Turkish airspace, you're going to get shot down. Yeah, thank you, you're on the Turkish side, mate. Can't be on that side of the line. My boys target uh, helicopter 12, two miles. Times two. Nail 15, watch out for Sam's guys. Uh, something. Well, 304, two helicopter targets in our airspace. I found those for a bit, though. just spray them a bit then as well. White, Huey, and Brake. Apache, they're both friendly, aren't they? Yeah, they are. There's the Huey. Thing loading. There's the Apache. No. Scratch it, it's a gazelle.
Okay guys, we need to head to the west sector. That is a heading of uh, 260 for us. Coming down to 400 knots. We're going to get to feet wet, guys, before we turn around again. Lead fuel, 8,000. 8,000. Five thousand. Five thousand. Yeah, okay, call site. There are two vehicles just north of the road, in between the large white and small grey building, next to two uh, hay haystacks. Guys, when we hit the coast, it will be a right pole, 2080. Yeah, take a left turn better, Cap, because you're about to cross the enemy line there. Aye, aye. Cap reversing left to 080. Roger. Meet you here. Roger. The helicopter's fine. So what's the stipulation for it being a baddie? Can anyone remember? Because we're running Soviet gear, aren't we? Uh, no, I think we're running US gear, aren't we? Yeah, but we're running Soviet. Soviet. Who's, who knows the answer to this? Sure, no, the enemies are running US gear, so anything uh, NATO is enemy. So uh, M113s, uh, Cobras, and so on are, are enemies. Roger. Well, this is a friend then. We uh, hind on our side. Hey, from. Well, that's a hind. Right, let's check all these helicopters, guys. It's a hind. The uh, last vehicle's dead, though. Okay. Oh, that wasn't bad lag. Okay, we've got some hostiles identified. Does anyone know where they are? Yeah, they look like Heinz, and just north of here is uh, enemy airspace. Roger, I mean, this is technically the west, uh, the eastmost of our designated third guys. What do you want to do? So we should do a 180 west again, I guess. All right, let's go 280, uh, hang on. 260, let's go, go, go. Oh, we just uh, can't find anything. Uh, oh, coming ground fire. Roger, there is ground fire in that city. Hostiles, the helicopters are taking it out. Were you flying in their area? Can you get to Akatori or Kingsfield? Going to attempt, oh, never mind. Visual. Did you go down? 
something's going on, I don't know what it is. Yeah, I've got to assume they're friendly. Hey, Raph, did you go down? Come on, get him. I'm going to assume we lost him. I don't know where he was. Yeah, somebody got taken down. Roger. Oh, All right, I mean, that's ground fire. We're not designated for ground fire. Uh, I'm circling three choppers at the moment. Uh, the airbase uh, dropping flares occasionally just to mark the area. What type? I think they're off limit if I've understood the mission right. It's also where the ground fire was. You with me, hi? Roger Cap, right behind you, man. I think there was a missile on you. Check your nine, Cap. Hello. I'm missing something. I got hit, guys. Nails, F4, Phantoms. Or one o'clock up. Roger, I'll make sure we're not in their airspace. Yeah. Yeah, let's take a left here. Let's break to 190. Yeah, Tommy, I'm seeing a lot of um, friendly helicopters at Ayanapa on the beach. Ayanapa, Ayanapa, Ayanapa. Should we do our east leg again, uh, high? Yeah, let's keep going just a little bit to the edge of those mountains and then we'll take a left turn and go back uh, to zero. Water, water. Yeah, yeah, let's let's take if we go low, my plane might go so bad I can't see a bloody thing. Come on, baddie choppers, where are you? Tanky, progress. Hi, plenty by accident. They were attacking uh, ground units at the uh, airfield. Roger. Out of fuel and nitro RTP. Okay, you're going back to rearm, okay? Well, I'll, I'll stay here. You go back to RTP, rearm, and when you're rearmed, I'm back here, I'll go back to RTP. Copy. Right, sir, so is where all the action is, Cap. We keep going a little bit longer, and then we'll take a, a right. Roger, helicopter on the nose, presume friendly, will intercept. Gazelle intercepted, presuming friendly. Right pull westbound. Eastbound, eastbound. Heavy smoke trail on the nose, airborne. 110. I know Phantom's made a lot of smoke. He is a fast mover, look at him go. What is that? Really fast mover to our south. Where has he gone? Cap, there's F4s around. I just had F4 on the RW to the north. Yeah, I saw something really smoky that I could only think was a Phantom or a MiG. But it buzzed me at Mark, over Mark 1, I couldn't catch eyes on it. On the RWR of the F4. Ali, Ali, are you heading westbound? Yeah, I'm heading eastbound, I'm right at the far end of the island at the moment, so on the last, uh, you know, as far as you can go. Roger. Just that. Uh, by grandfather. 
So just north of Iron Napa by about three miles if you've ever been there. I've not had the pleasure. <laughs> Harrier, it's a Harrier. Oh, where are his baddies been? You weird mission maker. Must be somewhere. Bloody hind. God damn it. Parachute, there's a... No. What the hell was that? It's a Huey. Hello, Huey. Gazelle. Friendly. Ah, dog damn it, I can't find nothing. Bloody hind. Fast mover Harrier. I reckon he's forgot to put the bad guys in because I've not seen a single baddie yet. Yeah, only Spike F4, but they're far away, I guess. It's a nail, not a spike anyway. It's a spike when he locks you. Lost our helicopters, but uh, that's it. We've not even seen any choppers. Where have you seen your choppers? Well, basically, wherever you see some smoke, it's them, it's the horrible buddies of attacks, attacked us. And, uh, and got either ground troops or there's been helicopters there. Noted. I think we're going to have to <coughs> go more assertive, viewers. Or I think we're going to have two hours of sitting here doing nothing. Let's go more assertive. Let's look for smokestacks. Hi, I'm going to start looking for some smokestacks and trying to find some trouble. I can hear someone speaking Mexican in the background. Uh, so, do the uh, Turks have Hawk missile sites? Anyone know? Not sure. Oh, right, okay. Well, that's what's trying to have a go at me. Peter, to just switch on these Hawk missile sites. Traffic, safe There's a guy. See that? Someone shooting. Where was where that from? Hostiles. Hostiles on the ground. Come on, let's do something. Shit, how do we use the bloody gun? Oh, I didn't bring a gun. Oh, cap. God damn it. I didn't bring a gun. Arrgh. Can't do anything. Maybe I can give them a, a good scare. There they are. You see them? Those little triangles? I'll give them a good scare. Are hey, you? Pull up, pull up. <laughs> Have some of that, knob heads. Knob heads and bell ends is all I see there. Board viewers have got nothing to shoot and nothing to do and I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Are the down? Maybe if I accidentally sneak into Turkish airspace, that will cause some excitement. What I can do is buzz friendly aircraft. That hind's getting shot. Another hind. We've been here for 45 minutes and seen nothing. I'm going to actually go back to base, get some air to ground weapons, and do some bombing. I don't think we're going to see any action. Look at that. Roger, keep a couple of sidewinders just not sure. I'm going to some of that to head back anyway. Roger. Viewers, I've got an idea. Prepare to be amazed. I'm not sure yet. Yes, I'm baby. Pull on, pull on. Splash nothing. RTB. 
for a Valley viewers. I've wanted to fly around doing nothing for two hours. I'll get MS twenty twenty. What vector is it tanking? Uh, I've got heading two one seven zero one eight zero nine. You're on enemy airspace. Go. Shit. Sorry. Wrong way. You're good. You wanna go? I think for you. You wanna be seven miles. Kingston for Cap's gonna be one two nine for twenty miles. One two nine for twenty. Roger. Uh, question from High Beam. We carriers can rearm at Kingsville, correct? That's correct, but uh, that's the other uh, little patch in there. Kingsville is a lot closer to the action cap, that's why we're going there. Right? Oh my god. I'm in shot up by a friggin' hawk site. Evasive. Yeah, cap that's a hawk site, it killed me. Huh, how about that? Come on, come on. Can we get sidearms in this uh, scenario? Let's go get it. Can we do that? That'll be nice. Evaded. Due east from where you are. Roger. East. And you should see some smoke on the nose shortly. And it's just the other side of the smoke. Watch out for there's lots of um, lots of friendly helicopters in the area. There's the base viewers. Seven miles on the nose cap. Visual. It's going to land a thing. You're just about to fly over blood. Sorry, underneath blood. Huh. Alright. In the break, Kingsfield. Oh, it's a short runway, look at that. Just walk up to watch out for the hawk site when you downwind camp. Hmm. Final Kingsfield. Alright, just land a suck of humans. It's a really short runway, isn't it? Reverse thrust. No, 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 you don't. Lag. Saved it. Done the safe. All the bombs you ever done see. And a frigging gun. A big gun. That one gun. Rearming. Request rearming. MI8 there. MI8 is a goodie question mark? Must be. They were guys in MI8, yeah, docks or um... Yeah, it's got a GR logo on the side of it. I'm taking off, hi. Right, concentrate, don't screw this up. Roger, I'll join in the air. Right, hopefully this runway is long enough. When you take off, flow south, then west to avoid the SAM to the north and enemy territory. Roger. I'll meet you over the way, I'm turning to your night, sir. Power! Easy. Oh, 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 that's a close one. Westbound. Roger. I'm at Angel 4. We can do this. I'll tell my for position. Keep going west. It's an Apache, an Apache. I'm gonna pop a couple of flares here if you're used to see me. Just gonna go and bug this guy. Can't help it. Urge to bug. Too high! 
According to F10 map, we've got a target right next to us. Hi, I'm going to turn around and have a look. Oh, you're on right behind you now, man. I got your visual. You're turning left. I'll be right high. Right, uh, right. I'm going to the Eden site. That was the target. Right, sorry. Um, because they're on British soil there, so definitely going to go for that. But it's all mostly infantry APCs there, so we should be okay. Roger, engaging. Okay, I'm looking for him now. Hi. Right, follow. You want to see the target? Follow the Apache. Roger. There's the Apache. Where's the target? There's an Apache down there flaring. There's an Apache firing his gun below us. Do you see the target down here, hi? I see smoke on the road, I keep dead targets on the road, do you see them? Sam, 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 Sam. He just shot a friggin' Apache down. I think we should go and kill that Sam site. I see the smoke trail. Confirm you see the smoke trail? Respond high. Daddy, he's coming trail high. Let's go get him, no? Yeah, he just shot a buddy down. Let's go and do him. Son of a bitch. Cap at 013, six miles. Roger, roger, roger. Wow, we were offering six miles from a friggin' Hawk site. I'm not set up! Five miles. On the nose. Alright, you son of a bitch. Cap running in. Visual. Cap tally. Pull up, pull up. Alright, finally, up. we get to do some friggin' up, flying. Hi, Tally, running in with a gun. Pull up, pull up. Pull up, pull up. So Harry was designed for, baby. Pull up, pull up. Pull up, pull up. Oh, fuck! Oh shit, I got man pads, I got man pads! Get out of there, hide, don't go in! I got something! Oh, what a miserable day, viewers! I hate something! I'm getting. Well done. Oh. oh, that's not a good way to go! I'm so on fire. No, I'm not. I'm alright. I'm alright. Hold together, you stupid bucket. Pull up, pull up. I can trim it out. I can trim it out. I can't trim it out! Just up, I'm 100% not up. Destroy it. I did mess it up a little bit though, you did too. I don't know, maybe. I think it's got a man pad. I think a man pad hit me high. I'm, it's probably not worth risking it. Go and find a nice juicy target, I'll find one for you. Yeah, it's that smoke in the distance. Oh yeah, Sally, there, attacking there, yeah. Light armored convoy. Let's go get him, 25 mic mic. Good son. Three units there, finish it off high. Royal well, Ronnie Fakin. So high switch, so I wanna have to throw the sidewinders in there. Roger Roger. You are clear to do so now. Just move, just see what happens. On my screen it just bugged and they disappeared because he's yes. Oh! Scratch that, you killed him. Cool. Hi, <laughs> Winchester, nothing on me now. Alright, go to Kingsville.
their mating. Boy destroyed. At least I didn't have to lug bloody pallets around with mission. Oh. UN base is shooting oh, the UN chopper. Taking fire at the LZ West. If I could get somebody that has guns, I'd appreciate it. There you are, aren't you? Uh, Mark, man, no guns. Oh no! Oh, good lord! What a time to catch him! That's an easy repair job. Plus, those ammunitions will be fine. Any worry, valued viewers. Stick it down high, that's some more dirt. Roger. A thing happened. I just found one of the helicopters we were supposed to be looking for. I think it's Tuxel. You did a thing, Hyde. I did a thing. I know. I don't know how to fly this thing. No. <laughs> I guess that's it, right? Away. When you get a chance, look at the air to ground scoreboard. They've killed like 300 units. Royal, let's see. Uh, I think we'll go flight by flight, Cap, and then whoever's not available, I'll fill in the blanks and do a little wrap up at the end. Okay, well, my guys, we stuck together for the first hour. We took off. We went to our designated centre zone of patrol. We. Am I right in saying we didn't see a single helicopter? I didn't see anything to shoot down. Did any of my other guys find any airborne targets to shoot? Uh, yeah, I do. And apologies to Blight. Um, there was ground fire coming up and it ended up being a uh, bit of a frasticide incident. Right, so the only thing we managed to kill with a whole mission was one friend. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll give you Springfield of Grim Reapers. Right, uh, then by an hour of flying around doing nothing, I was so bored, I went and got some bombs and went to go and bomb something, but myself and I got distracted by a beautiful, uh, what was it, a hawk site, just across the border? Yep. So we charged it, trying to be heroes. It turns out it had man pads and it blew us to pieces. That's the end of us. Uh, high end tanky survived. Uh, that's it, next flight. So nothing achieved, next flight. I said hello on Matrix, took off. Uh, I had some problems with my landing gear. Hmm. Now, uh, Fell off the ramp, so I respawned, got back up, uh, went to the AO, uh, me and Matrix engaged a couple of helicopters, and I uh, flew into a tree. <laughs> not, not a good Matrix day for Hello either. <laughs> yeah, then I went and got in a tank. I went and got in a tank, and I went to the range, and I uh, blew some stuff up. Good man. Yeah, Matrix is 
Selim, but um, yeah, took off. Had a nose wheel damage on the takeoff from the carrier. Mm, yeah, it's annoying. So uh, respawned, uh, headed off. We found a helicopter on the ground just our side of the green zone, went to have a look, and they started shooting at us, so we thought we'd return the compliment. Shot up a few ground troops. Elo hit something. But we uh, took out a few people, and I then climbed up and just did cap, did air refueling, carried on doing cap until Greek Mirage 2000s turned up and turned the uh, situation's temperature up a lot and went down and shot down some Turks. Huh, how about that? Uh, right, next. Colt, uh, so Ali B and Macabre, and we had Bendy in a, in a Hawk with us. We all got airborne from Akateri, headed east over Larnaca, kept going towards Kingsfield, set up a cap east-west uh, just on the coast there, just south of Kingsfield. Um, we had information that was four helicopters just to the north of us, uh, which were about two or three miles northwest of Kingsfield. We went searching them. I spotted them as we whizzed past. We then uh, uh, had a go at them. I think we got one down and there was one stuck on the ground. Uh, Wrote us running, but I'm not sure it happened. I found Obviously him at the end, somebody... just before I logged out. He was still there. Lol. Yeah, well, I think he didn't, I don't think he had a tail. I think Bendy no. basically sorted, it, sorted him out. Mm -hmm. um, there were some APCs there and Bendy spent a farewell, farewell having a go at those and unfortunately he died huh. in the service um, doing it. So... Um, um, Macabre went back to Akatu to rearm, refuel. I hung around and uh, was sniffing around the green zone and that nasty hawk site that uh, took Cap out, mm. took me out. I actually saw it. Um, obviously, for the first 50 minutes, it didn't illuminate and then it just started illuminating and then a uh, nasty thing got me. Mm -hmm. So that was the end of my day and Macabre uh, came back and uh, held up a fort and made sure uh, there was no other aircraft around our area and that's it for us. All right. Uh, next flight. Next flight. Humors. Oh, I guess mm. Tuxel's not here. I'm here, but you can do it, Bean. Oh, but well, you were flight lead, but... Yeah, but I don't like talking. Go on. Oh, okay. Oh, I love talking, as you all know. So, yeah, that's uh... <laughs> <laughs> um, Yeah, so uh, we took off um, from HMS Ocean. Uh, Tuxel was lead. Uh, me and number three pushed number two. Um, beautifully escorted by the Apaches. Uh, got to Kingsfield, picked up our troops. Uh, the Apaches went ahead and... Um, scouted out the uh the warehouse near the water park uh managed to to take out uh well i won't talk for them because they're going to talk for themselves but uh anyway they did their job and then we went in landed our uh, our troops and uh, thoroughly rifled through the warehouse looking for evidence uh we headed back to kingsfield uh and then i think tuxel had some engine problems so he switched over to maybe tactical commander or something um myself and push rearmed uh and uh Right at the end there, I was having a lot of fun. Um, I took out an M113 and, and a Cobra with uh, with my Puma. And uh, yeah, that was it for me. Push, Tuxo, anything to add? Be the Bell 212s, um, unarmed Huey's, myself, Shrek, and Lucky flying out of Nicosia, or around Nicosia. Um, I had to reference... Uh, Cap's flight about how to sling load, so I did all the... Um, Troop transports to the west, central, and eastern uh, spots. During one of the central spots, uh, when I let the troops out, they decided to run under my skids, so I c they killed themselves, two of them, uh, and that's a them problem. Mm -hmm. um, otherwise, it was very successful, and then I tried to sling load some ammunition to the western LZ, and I got shot down, and that was huh. basically my day. Uh, lucky anything? Yeah, I... Uh... Sling loaded um, uh, F frame and barrels and landed at uh, LZ West. I just des <laughs> destroyed a sling the first load. I sling loaded the uh, cargo and uh, I uh, destroyed it on landing. And then when I went back to resupply the sling load, I took fire. I think it was a, SU, uh, a ZSU-57. Took some hits, but I took the uh, load back to Nicosia, landed. And uh, that was my flight. Next flight. Uh, Apaches were <clears throat> took off and escorted the Pumas to Kingsfields, where they picked up their troops. Then we went ahead to the harbour where the speedboats were hiding, destroyed any of the targets there, allowing the Pumas to come in and put their teams down. 
escorted them back to Kingsfield and then went hunting and took out a few targets in a few of the towns uh, further west. I got shot down by a hawk just at the very end there, and Ooh. I think modern space chef survived. There you go. Lots of killing from all the helicopters. All the attack helicopters they had about 50 kills. It was ridiculous. Next, guys. RT and the Gazelle uh, took off. It was a very short trip to the uh, enemy FARP. Uh, so I took out a ZSU-23 and I think another 50 mil AAA uh, with my tow missiles and a couple of uh, troops as well. Uh, the Heinz then came in and cleared anything else up, so I flew back rearmed and went and patrolled the green zone. Uh, found a few people. There were lots of Turkish units that were on their side of the zone that were not firing at me, so I left them well alone. They were actually destroyed a bit later on by, I think, the Heinz. Um, but I got a total of nine kills. But the last part of last probably 30 minutes was very quiet. Next slide, please. All right. Next is the Cypriot National Guard Heinz. Uh, myself, Red O, Blight, and Chopsticks. So we took off. We were escorted by the very competent Artie, who kept us very safe on our short transit. We couldn't have done it without him. He kept us safe. And, uh, yeah, he blew up all the uh, AAA for us, so all we had to deal was deal with, like, 113s and very, very short-range, angry dudes. So we uh, we set up a racetrack pattern, putting missiles on any other vehicles that were in the AL. And then one by one, we landed, delivered our troops to the area, and overran the area with smiles huh. for everybody. So, yeah, um, also our... Gunners got extra use today. Um, after that, we RTB'd back to uh, Nicosia, rearmed, refueled, and patrolled the green zone. And anything that was red was dead. Wonder Boys, yep. Like I said, total kills of about 250 today, so that was crazy. Uh, next flight, please. Uh, I'm expecting on a Mirage. Uh, took off with a jigsaw from a Papos. Uh, started patrolling the green zone from west to east. Uh, Jigsaw spotted some MI8s, uh, we intercepted them, uh, we got no answer, so we engaged them, destroyed them as we were landing. Uh, Jigsaw had an encounter with a tree due to a uh, lag. Uh, so I clipped on uh, on the green zone, uh, eventually saw uh, Harrier getting taken out by a man pad. Uh, got distracted with some helos and uh, ended up getting engaged by that same man pad. Uh, tried to make it back to the base uh, with missing one wing. I was surprised how well it was flying. But half the way there, it just departed, so I had to eject, and that was it. I think Jigsaw took off again, and uh, he got destroyed by Hawk. Oh, right, Roger. Okay. Uh, that's all the flights, isn't it, guys? Uh, it's been summarized. How do you feel about that? Yeah, uh, sorry, it was a bit of a disappointment for you, Cap. I guess it's difficult to do combat air patrols when you don't have a radar. I hmm. uh, guess, uh, go figure, right? Hmm. Um, but looking at the general overview, I mean, it, it, it did a pretty good job of uh, dissuading most of the helicopters, apart from the kind of fringes, if you like, the far east to far west of the island. It's quite clear the TRNC have uh, made good on their threat to occupy UN land. Uh, the areas closest to the sovereign base area and around Nicosia, um, it looks like pretty much all the ground troops were defeated. So that's great. That means the airfield there stays in our hands. And uh, for the next mission, um, it's clearly a big escalation. And then, of course, right at the end there, you have, we weren't sure if the, if the Turks, uh, you know, the, the, the sort of mainland Turkish forces were going to get involved. But, I mean, the Greeks firing on the uh, Phantom F4s is clearly going to escalate things uh, and the Hawk sites firing on people. So, um, yeah, overall, um, pretty good mixed bag. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's definitely going to escalate further next week and uh, we'll have to get some uh, Greek Mirages and F-16s in. To right. come. So, yeah, good. Well, that man said, um, good one, guys. I'll see you next week. See you, Cap. See you. Bye, guys. 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 Bye, guys